What's up, YouTube? Spider here, Jalen here, bringing another YouTube video. And today we're going to be talking about how the World Reveal trailer of Black Ops 3 is going to be out in one day. One day, I know it's pretty crazy. You know, I made a video about two weeks ago saying that that brand, the first Black Ops 3 trailer was out, and you know, we all thought it was crazy, you know. But now there's so much stuff, there's so much information that has came out today. Like the yesterday, this new, or maybe it was two days ago, the new tra Ember trailer. It was actually absolutely crazy. It was showing like all these superhumans. Like the campaign's gonna be a lot about superhumans and stuff. And I don't know, I find it kind of weird, but I find it really, really cool too, you know. I think it's gonna be insanely cool. I think it's gonna be insanely cool. I really do. I think it's gonna be really, really, really cool because I don't know I like do I like the future not really I prefer you know the past I like the old wars I think that's just really cool you know I really like the old war I like the war scene uh, you know black ops 1 is my favorite call of duty I just love that I I really want to be like black ops 3 because the black ops 1 favorite call of duty I love that call of duty so much I've had so much fun on it I really want the zombies to be more simpler in black ops 3 too and yeah, it's pretty much like my wish list for Black Ops 3, no exos, and I have some I have some information on the movement. No exos, um, no variant weapons. Um, that's pretty much it, honestly. Like I, I really want um I really want a good league play because I never got to play league play that much in Black Ops 2 because I was more of just like a pub stomper, you know, you know what I mean? And I played zombies a lot in Black Ops 2 too, so I didn't really have too much time to play competitive and league play and all that good stuff because I didn't really know too much about it. But, alright, let's get right into this. Let's get into the movement. So, they said no exos. I know all of you are probably clapping your hands. Well, technically, no, nothing is released. That pi this picture could be fake. But this picture was uh, leaked, and it said this: the movement is going to be traditional. Well, the maps are going to be traditional. Like, you know, it's a traditional movement. Well, the maps are for traditional movement, except for there's, like, a, um, advanced, like, advanced movement to it like it's not just like you know slow paced walking i think what they mean by that is, is you know like in exosuits you can double jump you can dash you can do all this stuff i think they're gonna keep the dashing or maybe they'll do like free running maybe you know um what's a what's a game um i i want to say like titanfall almost like how you could like run on walls and stuff yeah let's go with titanfall but like almost like titanfall you can run on walls and stuff and like free run I think either like that or, you know, just dashing and stuff like that. Because a lot of people like the dashing and I preferably love the dashing. I think it's really awesome because you get to dodge the bullets and it's just really cool. It's a really cool aspect of the game. And then, um, like I said, they the maps are built for just traditional Call of Duty and I think that's pretty freaking sweet. And, um, you know, I just, I really think this is going to be a really cool Call of Duty because... I don't know, you know, we're, everything is going to be found out, yes, I mean tomorrow. One day from today, everything will be found out, you know, every single detail, not every single detail of this game, that won't be until November, but still, a lot of information is going to be found out tomorrow, and, you know, we'll see, we'll see how, if there's exos, if there's not, you know, that picture obviously could be fake, you know, every, anything could be fake, and, uh, there was like a leaked weapon list, and this could be fake, could be fake, but the SMGs, I was looking at the SMGs, and I saw the Vector. That could be fake. Could not. Hmm. I would, I would be down for the Vector, dude. I mean, like, obviously, it was like a Melt Machine and Ghost. Like, it was crazy. It was like an AR and Ghost. But I don't know, man. Hey, man, I would be down for it. I'd be down. As long as it's not as overpowered as it was in Ghost. If Maybe if it's like a BO2 or like an MW2 version of the Vector. That would be freaking sweet. That would be sweet. And I'm really, really hyped for Black Ops 2, and I'm pretty sure all of you guys are too. I just said Black Ops 2 when I meant Black Ops 3. I'm pretty sure every single person on this earth who plays Call of Duty is ready for Black Ops 3 because AW, it was kind of like a hit or miss situation with the exosuits, and I think it was a miss. A lot of people, um, they prefer, they, I mean, a lot of people are going back to Black Ops 2 and stuff, and when I say that is I just see that on my time on Twitter, so yeah. <laughs> But, you know, that's pretty much all I had to say about Black Ops 3. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a thumbs up, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.